Hello everybody, this is Ruler of Ice, and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Revelations. Now I'm going to continue where I left off last time, so let's get down to it right now. And hopefully this will be the last episode. Previously on Resident Evil Revelations. Come clean with us, O'Brien. Don't leave anything out. Everything is in perfect order. No, it isn't. Enjoy the rest of the celebration on the Queen Dido, Norman. <laughs> Raymond realized that Morgan was not who he seemed. So we set this trap together. The whole Veltro Revival Act. The mountain hideout, and the coordination of the ships, all to put heat on Morgan. But I haven't given up yet. They've left us with an ace in the hole. The third queen. The third ship. Episode 12. The queen is dead. The final queen. Yes. Queen Dido. She's been resting on the ocean floor since that day. Which means we'll find her. A Terra Grigia. Exactly. We have a responsibility to see this mission through. O'Brien out. So we're going back to Terra Grigia. <sighs> oh, are you kidding me? show over. The BSAA is hereby under the direct supervision of the FBC. Clive R. O'Brien, you are under arrest for collaborating with the terrorist organization Veltro. Chris, Jill, you're our only hope. Remains of Terra Grigia. And the Queen Dido. Approaching drop off point. Here we go then. If the virus here is destroyed, then what's left? Would it really turn after all these years? After one year, that is. Yeah. I can actually put away the magnum weapon if I won't find any ammo. Also, I can't scan this room. So let's continue. Thank you. 
two ways. Which way is the right one? Oh man, there are a lot of sharks here. Full health and full health item. What's with the music? Oh man, oh, 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 oh. Something's still alive. Careful, you won't be able to fight them off underwater. Oh, thanks a lot. I don't have grenades, really. A pick rifle ammo update. Well, where did it go? Two ways, but one is locked. Can I open it? Door is locked. Needs electricity. It's an electric lock. I hope the emergency power still works. Right. The wires are all pulled apart. I'll fix them. Okay, I'll see if I can get the power going. What is with the music, though? of them get a pulse grenade but I can't use it why in the world can I use it it's because of this suit Oh, I see. They don't see me. There we go. Jill, the door's open. Okay, on my way back. Yeah, I can just follow them up. They don't, they won't see me. Oh, wait a minute, I have to... I have to get to the other side. Well, this sucks. Now. <sighs> that was close. That was easy. 
How's the ammo situation? Quite good, actually, I'd say. And they're still on dry area. There's still air. But nobody's been breathing it, so I'll, I'm not really surprised. Who's that? He hasn't been dead for long. Wait, they been here? FBC. He's FBC. There's something in his hand. Is this the agent? Voice recorder. This is Agent Dario Barioni. ...of the FBC Armed Forces. The time is 1948. I request that this recorder be handed over to General Lansdale. If found by the next team, everyone on my General. team is dead. Killed by the devil himself. We were unable to retrieve the video log. Our mission has failed. Weltro, they weren't sitting around waiting for death to come to them. When the FBC arrived, they were waiting for us. Even though Terra Grigio was a year ago. Thoughts of revenge kept them alive. Oh, this is going to be painful, especially if there are invisible enemies here. Wow, that was a lot of shotgun shells. Oh my god. What is happening with the lights? Dante Alighieri's La Divina Commedia an offering to the dead. A passage has been underlined. How the rain make them like underdogs. One side they make a shelter for the other. Off turn themselves the wretched reprobates. Dante Alighieri's La Divina Commedia. Inferno Canto 6. There is something written at the edge of the page in sloppy handwriting. 
Those who offer their lives to the doctrine will all walk the path of the great Jack Norman. Hmm. The original leader of Eltro. The Queen Dido is already deep below the sea. Death. There's no escape. No chance of survival. Unless. He's going to infect himself. So he's the final virus then. Ah, uh, Veltro. In honor of thy name, we accept our wrongdoing and transmute our flesh in remembrance of our sins. But for you, Morgan, never shall there be rest. We rise from the dead. A spirit callous and immutable force. <laughs> All of our interactions are right in here. We shall become guardians of the truth for as many years as it may take. Jack Norman was the head of Veltro. And he has the video we can use to nail Lansdale. The video was shot here. All right. Critical one. And Josh shot two. Charge shot. Only three magnum ammo. That's not good. I would rather have something else. But what? The only thing I can take really is is the sniper rifle. That's not good. That's not good. One thing though, by the way, reload. Only three magnum ammo. That's really not good. So I'm not going to take the magnum. I'm not going to take the magnum. Also, um... I'm going to take these out. And then... I hate to do it, but... I will take the sniper rifle. It's not good. It's not ideal here. At all. Is there anything I can do here, though? I already have damage 2, apparently. And fire rate 30... Fire rate 2, alright. Critical 1. What if I take Ops Critical Rate by 
What's this charge shot though? You can perform a charge shot by holding down the fire button. Charge time is long, the firepower goes up. But what weapon is that for? An electric weapon. I don't know what that is, but There's not much else I can do here. I'll keep the shotgun out. Can't do anything hel else here, so let's go. Let's go face the boss, the leader of Veltro. It's an FBC corpse. Guess they were looking for clues too. Vengeance of God. Oh, how much artest thou? He's still alive after after each one to be dreaded who doth read that which was manifest unto mine eyes After one year he's still alive Pape Satan Pape Satan Aleppe Each one shall find again his dismal tomb shall reassume his flesh and his own figure shall hear what through eternity re-echoes vengeance of god oh how much artest thou by each one to be dreaded who doth read that which was man <laughs> He hasn't even mutated yet. Morgan! Morgan Lansdale! How dare you cross Veltro! Morgan, this is what you seek, is it not? <laughs> Indeed, this little machine contains the truth. All oh, the truth needed to bring down your entire charade. This is it. We got the evidence. We have to go. We don't want to wait around for this. He doesn't see anyone else but Morgan. That was actually a bit of a horrifying, quite atmospheric, atmospheric. Kind of like, um... Kind of like the... Leon section of Reson in Resident Evil 6. Pretty much like that. I like that. Oh man, this is going to suck. Though. <sighs> Let's go. Well, I see that we stop. Morgan isn't here. It's no use. He's gone over the edge. I don't think 
he's in the mood to say goodbye. Yeah, but we're not here to babysit. How am I supposed to dodge that? Okay, I don't know what to do here. Oh, I see. All right, come on. Really? that on its back I'm going to take a guess and say it's really I can't dodge it. I can't dodge it. It's do, it's do or die. Ah, wrong one. Damn it! What's the point of that? That's so unfair! Yeah, again! That's so unfair! And I have no healing items there. Really? And now it's going to fake out. Now it's faking out. I have no more healing items. Yeah, it's the one in the back that's my main target. I'm dead. Yeah, this is not good. Also, I should have probably used grenades. We 
reload. I don't think he's in the mood to say goodbye. Okay, don't get too close either. Easier said than done. It's so unfair. I can't, I can't aim that. Yeah, I can't do that. Damn it, this is hard. And now it's faking out. Is it? Yes. Oh, it was behind me. Wait a minute, was I able to press F there? Did I do it? <sighs> Done. Everything finished.
Now the final queen is going to be destroyed. And Veltro is finally truly finished. This is how Morgan treats his friends. I hope he finds more comfort in death than he did in life. of dispersion the cruise ship is equipped with a UAV that is your delivery system very well now show me the goods bonafide tea abyss no vaccine not yet yes of course a little bit of this could turn a city inside out. I think we're done. I'll be on my way. Who would have thought, yes? That the lowly terrorists would receive a helping hand from the venerable commissioner of the FBC. And there's the evidence. As you can see, it's not likely you'll be wriggling out of this one. I seem to have underestimated the BSAA, and perhaps you as well. We found this in the off-limits area near Terra Grigia. We're done analyzing it, so you can have it back. Director O'Brien, surely you understand our dilemma. No. Without the Terra Grigia panic, the ignorant masses would be unaware of the threat that lies before them. You. Yes, you may in fact be correct. No one has the right to detain me. The world required my guidance. It was all for the greater good. You're only fooling yourself. You said yourself, abandon hope, all ye who enter here. But I'm not Dante. You're not Virgilius. Morgan Lansdale, you are hereby relieved of your position as FBC commissioner. And I'm placing you under arrest on suspicion of conspiring with Veltro in the planning and execution of the Terra Grigia panic. With all due respect, Director O'Brien, the BSAA is making a huge mistake. The mistake was you. They didn't do all the decisions. Where have I heard that before? so weird, always having the villain uh, justify the means. We can finally reveal what happened to Terra Grigia. Yeah, but the cost was high. The BSAA will have to be overhauled. The storm is gone now, but how long will it last? Not long, considering this is situated. After Morgan Lancel's arrest, the FPC was dissolved, with the majority of its agents and resources transferred to the BSA. The BSA would then be reformed into an anti bioterrorism organization under the auspices of the United Nations. Oh. 
Oh, and these two survived? Chief Lumley is now a leading figure at BSA's East African branch due to his accomplishment at Falcon and Murky. Quick Ketchum, on the other hand, continues to refuse promotion to any leadership position, but he still works at the BSA's main headquarters in the R&D department. And this one survived too, and so did Raymond then. Parker Luciani was found adrift of offshore the Republic of Malta in the Mediterranean Sea and was rescued. Wait, where's Raymond then? After a month of medical treatment, Parker returned to his position as a special operations agent for VSA's main headquarters. Oh. Clive R. O'Brien decided to take responsibility for his actions, stepped down from his position as head of the BSAA. At least it wasn't a dishonorable discharge. He is currently an advisor to the BSAA, and he's also writing a detective novel from the comfort of his own home. And then this happens. And as for Jill Valentine and Chris Redfield, they have no idea what horrific fate awaits them. I do. Because that last scene was just before the events of Resident Evil 5. And that was Resident Evil Revelations. And in this series, it's going to be the this the last game that will have the replay in its title. I haven't played any of the rest of the Resident Evil games, so this is going to be something. Overall, overall, this was a good game. The only thing I didn't like were, were the controls and aiming, but that might have been in the option, called of the, in the options. I don't know, but I really dislike the, the cam, camera controls and aiming. And, like all the other Resident Evil games, this too was annoying as some in some parts, but not as much as other, some of the others. I guess this would be situated somewhere in the middle. Actually, no, it goes to the top. When it comes to best Resident Evil games. That I played at least. Uh, is it the best? Uh, no, no, that would be I actually don't know. At this stage, I guess the best Resident Evil game I have played is Resident Evil 2. I don't know where I would put this game, but this was good. This was absolutely good game to play. And what about this game going back to the roots of Resident Evil? Well, yeah. Yeah, I did in some parts at least. I mean, you had to dodge enemies without having guns or anything like that. So yeah. The final boss, by the way... Quite easy, actually, when you get down to it. 
It's only hard when you don't know what to do. Anyway, next up will be Resident Evil Revelations 2. That's going to be something. That's going to be something. Ugh. Also, I like the fact that this game actually had some levels in situated in Finland, apparently. Oh, by the way, what happened to Jessica? Oh, there you too easy, wasn't it? The company let them take Morgan out with the trash. Tough world. You file the report on this. By the way, why save Parker? I have my reasons. The BSAA isn't as useless as I thought. Things could really heat up. Indeed. The fun's just getting started. I wonder if that actually follows up in the... Follows up in the, uh... Custom parts Josh shot free for campaign use. What is Josh shot? But I wonder if this will actually follow up in Revelations 2. Because I don't think this follow this actually follows up in Resident Evil 5. Mm -mm. I don't think so at least. So it has to be Revelations 2. <laughs> Hydra, a free pipe shotgun. Oh, for clearing the normal mode. Okay. Congratulations, now you can use the save data to start a new game with all of your equipment intact. Would you like to save clear data? We shall suggest you save it yourself. Sure. I'll put it right here. Yeah. And that is that. Seven hours and seven minutes in total. Eleven deaths. And that was Resident Evil Revelations. <sighs> oh. Alright, I've already said my piece about this game, so I won't say anything more. Other than look forward to me starting uh, Revelations 2. I'm actually interested what that game is about. I don't know anything about it. So this is going to be something else then. So, thank you so much for watching this video, leave a like if you enjoyed, and subscribe to my channel for more videos, and check out my previous Let's Play videos of Han already, and I'll see you guys in the next game. Bye bye!